I destroyed my living room last night because I really, really had to create art. I did several different mediums and I'm about to do at least one, possibly two more before I finish and then I can get all this cleaned up. Okay, so now while that is drying, I get to go inside and clean up. Granted, my version of cleaning up is really just moving stuff from one place to another. So while my living room looks pretty okay, my basement is a completely different story. Now to talk about something kind of important. In my last video, I said, when you're a filmmaker, filming becomes work and work is no longer fun and this cat has become work. When just two weeks before that I had said, not having a work ethic is something I really regret and that's something I want to change about myself. There are two very important things that I completely underestimated. One, I'm not always going to want to work, especially when I'm cycling through depression. And two, work isn't always fun. My MO for the longest time has just been to quit something whenever it stops being fun for me. I've done this with classes and hobbies and after school activities, college majors, art projects, relationships. I don't see a point in continuing to waste time and energy on something that's no longer fulfilling you and not adding value to your life. And yeah, you can get wrapped up in the sunk cost fallacy, which is a really bad thing on its own, but there has to be a balance between the two extremes. If there's a specific goal that you're working toward and the value of that goal outweighs the temporary discomfort that you're feeling while working towards it, then you should keep going for it. Remember the video I never made? I talked about it in this video here. In that video that never got finished, I made this confession. And that is why I have pretty much stopped pursuing acting. It's just not fun anymore. I realize now that I didn't just quit acting because it wasn't fun anymore. I shifted away from that being my primary focus because my goals changed. My goal was now to find artistic and creative fulfillment. And I found that more behind the camera than in front of it. It's good to have goals and it's good to keep working toward them as long as the value of the work itself is adding value to your life. Does that make sense? And as far as this YouTube channel goes, I 